Well, happy Friday, everybody. It is going to be yet another hot and sunny day across the area. High pressure is going to continue to dominate our weather, so plenty of sunshine. Just a few of those high, thin clouds here and there. Otherwise, not much wind either, so it's going to be very reminiscent of yesterday with that heat and humidity, kind of a stagnant atmosphere out there. So again, you are going to be outside. Be sure to drink plenty of water and use caution as well. Tonight, clear skies. Once again, some fog is possible overnight. A weak upper level wave could spark a shower or thunderstorm to our far north and west this afternoon and evening hours. Only about a 20% chance or less. Now, most of the 4th of July now is looking pretty good. With a lot of sunshine, some clouds for the afternoon. There is a chance we could see a few stray showers and thunderstorms. The better chance will be across Minnesota, but it's only looking to be about a 30% chance at best and very isolated in nature. It's about a 20% chance for the Twin Ports and Wisconsin, and that will linger into Saturday night and Sunday. So overall, the 4th of July itself is looking pretty good. The humidity levels are still going to be pretty high, say in the upper 60s to near 70. It should taper down a little bit this afternoon into tonight and into our day Saturday, dropping back closer to 60, so a little bit better out there, but then it's going to go right back up into next week, even getting into the lower 70s potentially as we head towards the middle of the week. And again, hot today with highs in the mid to upper 80s to lower to middle 90s. A light lake breeze might develop in the afternoon, so areas along the lake shore may drop down into the 70s, but still very hot out there once again. And then dropping back into the 50s and 60s tonight with a clear to mostly clear sky. And also, too, some records may be set once again today. Duluth's going to be about two degrees shy of their record from 93 in 1990. Hibbing could tie theirs. International Falls might shatter their record today, which was previously set in 1990. And then looking ahead for the 4th of July is looking like this right now. Sunny to start, few clouds for the afternoon. Temperatures getting up towards 90 degrees and wind staying pretty light out of the south and southwest. And then chances of showers and thunderstorms linger Sunday through about Wednesday next week with temperatures in the mid to upper 80s and lows in the 60s.